New Orleans has become a hot spot for the virus with the number of cases jumping again overnight. And among the factors being studied by the Tulane School of Public Health is the people packing event that ended just three weeks ago. Mardi Gras. The investigative reporter Mike Perlstein talked to two of the experts. As we watch New Orleans climb the list of COVID-19 hotspots, researchers at the Tulane School of Public Health are crunching the numbers and studying the timeline. One recent event that fits the outbreak perfectly, Mardi Gras from parades to Bourbon Street. I think the timing definitely is right. This place was packed shoulder to shoulder with people from all over the world. The perfect Petri dish for COVID-19. According to Dr. Richard Oberhelman, the, the factors are line. all there. Uh, there's a lot of close personal contact. Uh, and so that's uh, the, the, the perfect opportunity for spread of, of viruses like uh, the one that causes COVID-19. As for the people in those carnival crowds, besides the fact that we have people from all over the world, what do you do at Mardi Gras? You go to parades. Dr. Ronald Blend says experts will be studying this epidemic for decades. But in New Orleans, the evidence pointing to carnival is mounting. I have to admit, the concentration, and it's a really strong concentration here in New Orleans, may suggest that. Now these experts are recommending and practicing the opposite behavior web conferencing in order to do things is so that people are not in direct contact with each other, which is the opposite purpose of Mardi Gras. Mike Perlstein, Eyewitness News. The epidemic has become such a fertile topic for research that Tulane has launched a daily newsletter on the virus. They're calling it Tulane Outbreak Daily, and we will be following the newsletter here for new insights.